It's finally here! Let me explain. About two weeks ago, I said if I reached 30,000 subscribers, I would wear a maid dress in fursuit. And I noticed that we completely demolished that goal. So viewers, I give you what you want. Is this what y'all wanted? Oh, here you go. Okay, what the fuck is that? Remember what I said last video about as long as you can keep the furries away from me, like far, far away from me, we'll be fine? Well, I think on my monitor screen, it's a little bit too close. And I just gotta say one thing. Thing. This looks absolutely horrible. Not really a big fan of what you got going on here. Whatever contraption this is supposed to be. Ah, but besides that. Hello guys, welcome back to another video. You guys know my name is Brion. And I wanted to come on here today to talk about... Yes guys, I know. Another PNG tuber. I'm sorry, I just had to. This one, out of all of them I'd say, is the worst. And I don't know, I probably said that for another PNG tuber. But man, that was clearly an understatement. Because I don't know how in the actual hell... 164,000 people have decided to subscribe to whatever this is. But if you guys didn't know, this is a PNG tuber who goes by the name of Frost Fox. And debatably, this is one of the worst, and I mean worst, Jelly Bean clone PNG tuber accounts we got here on the platform. And the reason why I say that is because of the video that you saw at the beginning of my video that you're watching right now. And I wanted to further highlight why I believe this might be the worst PNG tuber ever. And what better way to do it then to show you the content that this person is making god tier content take a look reading your red flags from twitter disliking hairless animals hairless animals are adorable y'all i just don't understand all the hate they get though they're so cute pouring milk before the cereal what is actually wrong with you i'm sorry frost furry but i'm gonna have to pull the uno reverse card on you and ask you what is actually wrong with you yeah, I'm gonna keep using that photo, by the way. Blue furries. Okay, how is this a red flag? You know, to be totally honest with you, this one kind of caught me off guard. I'm surprised there's somebody out there who actually decided to leave a good comment for once. Like, man's woke up today speaking facts. But yeah, for real. I mean, I understand that your color is blue, but you are literally a red flag. So, I mean, that one kind of made too much sense. Blue is the best color. And this doesn't mean I'm a furry, though. You know what? It's safe to say that I call bullshit. Because he says, and this this doesn't mean I'm a furry though. Yes, Frost Fox, totally not a furry. I mean, if you're not a furry, then how about this? Explain to me why you made this video right here. How to locate local furries near you. And also, how about this? Explain what the hell these videos are. How my school found out I'm a furry. How to become a Texan furry. What is the furry fandom? How I told my family that I was a furry. Do I even need to ask why the hell you made this one specifically? And nah, fam, you're totally not a furry, even though you uploaded this video of you going to a furry YouTuber meet and greet in 2017. Oh my god. I just gotta say one thing about this. To be totally honest, if you gave me an option between picking going to a furry convention or going to high school for the rest of my life, I would probably pick high school for the rest of my life because there ain't no way you're making me go to a furry convention, especially if you got a Five Nights at Freddy's character just staring at me like this, like they're about to make me lose the game or something. Like, man, you couldn't even pay me to do this. Your favorite PNG tuber is hiding something from you. Let me explain. You know how people People say PNG tubers are from a clone factory. Uh, yeah, that's because they do come from a clone factory, and Jelly Bean is the one who makes all the clones. You know, she handcrafts them in the factory, and I think she messed up a few of them, including yourself. Okay, these videos are really getting boring, so I have a better idea. Let's go check out this video. It's called How to Locate Local Furries Near You. Let me just say this now. When I first saw this title, I refused to believe that this was a real video, but I clicked onto the video, and and yes, it was real. This title also reminded me of those ads that you find on websites sometimes where it's like, find sexy babes in your area. One way that I find the furries near me is that I just go outside, I clear my throat, and shout out these magic words. Uh, hello? Is anyone a furry? Uh, I need friends. So, uh, if you're furry, please, please come here. Uh, 
I roleplay. A woo. I mean, if you're really into it, I think I heard a few dogs barking in this video, so, you know, I think they'd be down for some roleplay. But all jokes aside, this is literally just some dude in a furry costume just going outside of their house and yelling at the neighbors, just saying a whole bunch of random shit about how they want friends and how they want friends who are furries. Just all this weird shit. Now, I don't know if Frost Fox is, like, mentally okay, but I do know one thing for sure. I think I saw a little bit of grass out there in your video and i think you really need to start touching it at least once a day maybe twice hello hello hey hello, Hi. hello. Hi. Hi. um i am wondering where there's a furry meat so like do you know a furry meat please what, what, what's that? a furry meat i need to find a furry meat okay i, I get it what what is that animals go there like Animals, costumes, like they walk there. They're they're doing stuff. It's in Texas. Please, like. Wait, animals are wearing costumes. Yes. I mean, I gotta admit, that's the most base thing he said this whole video. Because he's not wrong when he says the animals are the ones who are wearing the costumes. I mean, that makes a lot more sense, doesn't it? Because I don't know one normal, rational thinking human being who would ever decide to do this. Like, there's just gotta be a different way. Or even a better way. This is off topic, but I figured I'd say it. I just can't believe that this person went from making these furry videos to becoming a P and G YouTuber. And as far as I know, the reason why Frost Fox became a PNG YouTuber is because they saw that Jelly Bean or another PNG YouTuber was doing really good and was blowing up with subscribers and getting a lot of attention. So they were like, oh hey, this is a good idea, so why don't I do it? I can get some clout, I can get some attention towards me, I can look like a fool and I'll have a few people out there who actually don't think I'm a fool. You know, it's the greatest idea. Idea. So you hear about all these jelly bean clones and how they copied her and I mean it just makes sense at this point But yeah, I think I'm done with making videos on these cringy furry PNG youtubers because I felt energized in the beginning of the video And then at the end I just got very sick and tired of watching some furry dude do some random shit on a video Like I don't understand how people find these people entertaining But I mean I guess you do you I don't know what else to say because these same people who are making these png videos are the same people who at one point went outside yelling at their neighbors saying things like that they wanted to do role play furry role play like it sounds like the most horrible thing to ever exist but i don't even know anymore all i know though is i think i'm gonna end the video right here i'm gonna wrap it up i don't know if i'm gonna be making any more png tuber videos because i've already made like i don't even know around five and some people are really getting pissed off that i keep making them so not sure if I'll keep making them or not. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button so it gets promoted more in the algorithm. If you're new to this channel and you like the video, make sure you subscribe because I'm trying to hit 15,000 subscribers before the summertime. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, or feedback, make sure you leave them down in the comments section down below and I will get to them. But yeah, guys, my name is Brion. Hoping I never watch this guy ever again. And I will see you in my next video. Peace.